from your mouth. That sounded crazy. <laughs> hey, man, you're not wrong. But Nobody I mean, wants to hear it. Listen, we got uh, Jackal and we got um, Gons right back in Grand Finals. Uh, Gons playing really well today. But, I mean, Jackal coming off that win against uh, Jackal. I mean, against Juice. And, yeah, coming off that win against Juice. Has a lot of confidence. Has a lot of momentum in his favor right now. Gons could be cold. There's a lot of factors that go into this. Or Gons could just yeah. be really fresh. I will admit... You know, maybe it's like a more like mid lower level player thing. There have been times where I've been in Grant's winner side of a tournament, and uh -huh. then I come back and I just get body, body, body because I haven't played in a minute. Yeah. You know, sometimes momentum that happens. Isn't there. Momentum is a thing. But that just uh, oh, and that back air, <laughs> we almost missed it. it happened so fast. Got, uh, Jack was doing a really good job of catching people's jumps because a lot of people want to jump over Wolf because they think that he can't get there, but he just reads the jump and you eat a back air for it. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, that wolf players love to do that off the yeah. dash tags. They love to like double jump, reverse, uh, uh, reverse aerial rush back air. Yeah, wolves just like get out of bed in the morning. They're like, I hope I hit somebody with that mix. <laughs> Word. I hope I hit somebody with that mix today. Okay. Here we go. Going out the neutral. Nice. Shining the explosive flame off. Of so he can shine the entire explosive flame. That's pretty nutty. Yeah. Ooh, and look at this, Jack making quick work. Of Gons right now, already on his last stock in this game one of Grand Finals. Jack will let him know, listen, I want to reset the bracket. Okay, damage, 23%. Easy butter, uh, bre bread and butter combos. Easy bread and butter. Okay, oh, but Palutena let him know I got some bread and butters of my own. Going to drop that fair into uh, Nair, though. Hey, man, any Nair you can Nair, I can Nair better. Uh, sounds right to me. I can Nair any Nair better than you. And it doesn't look like Jack could tech either because now he missed that tech. Now he's going to eat some damage for it. Trying to land on him with Nair. Uh, going to eat an up tilt for it. No jump. And uh, the damage. Look at him now. 103. And I don't know what Gans just did, but he did something. Immediately F tilted on that platform and was able to catch Jack with trying, to, um, trying to throw out a button. I like that patience right there. You see yes. him charging the attack. Knowing exactly where he needed to go. Forward throw. Toss him off. Okay. Throw more back on. I know where you're going to be. Yep. I'll grab you. I'm actually surprised that he got that grab. Okay. Just going to run in and dash attack. Listen, this is invincible. Nice. Okay, that could be good. Yep. He, he was forced to air dodge because of the uh, the, the fair. And then he ate a uh, nair because he had to go to, to the drop. Not, not, a, not, not a good position that uh, Wolf wants to be in. Yep. And here you go. All it takes is one nair string. Yep. Already 37% getting that damage. damage. Yep. Uh, Jackal, if he wants to win this, he has to end it like soon. He does not want to give Gans the opportunity because he will absolutely take it. Nair. Intercepting with the Nair. Yep. Intercepting with the dash attack. Double dash attack. Yeah. Oh, going for the up air instead of the back air right there. A back air would have launched him off, but it definitely would not have killed. But it would have yeah. put Wolf in a pretty bad position, putting him off stage. Yep, and just like, just like that, one over extension, and you need a back air from Wolf. It's super strong, man. Super strong. Yep. But here we go. Uh, no bands on the stage yet. Uh, Opting to go back to the wolf. Not picking Pichu. Not throwing that up in the air. I guess they just communicate. You can see. And it's funny because you see the house guys come on stream. They don't even, like, get up. They they just go straight to the, uh, yeah. the tablet. And then uh, you see the Jersey guys go up the stream, and they're actually still talking to each other, and they don't do anything on the tablet. <laughs> you got to remind them that they can use the tablet. <laughs> from Jersey. We don't got tablets over here. Yeah. House is a little too fancy for us. Mm, absolutely. Uh, but nonetheless, uh, is this match looking like... Oh, dead? Yo, he absolutely would have died. There was, there's no doubt in my mind that he would have died. He probably could have survived. Oh, here we but, go. Even game. Like, yo. Even game. Here we okay. go. The mix. I, I gotta notice, he doesn't really nair more than twice. He, like, tries to do it into an up air. I think he tries to get, like, more damage off that and, like, keep... Forcing him into a juggle. Yeah. I mean, I, I guess I'm not. You're dead. What? Why? Why did you do that just now? I, I can't see a valid reason why you would have air dodged there. Jackal didn't even get off the ground. Like, he was still on the ground and you just, like, air dodged. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But, I mean, Gon's probably is sending grants. He knows something that I don't know. For sure. But he's definitely taking this damage right now. Okay. Tries to read a spot dodge with that F smash. Jackal not giving it to him. Jackal playing super safe. Not putting himself in a situation. And look at that grab range. I'm telling y'all, y'all think Nair is the problem. My man got scooped. My man got yoinked. Here we go. Ah, uh, not going to punish that forward smash. 
kind of like Meta Knight. Once it comes out, you just gotta wait for the next it. option. Yeah. Ooh, not enough distance on the uppy right there. Jack will fall to his death. Yeah, and I feel like he had a jump there, but uh, maybe didn't want to use it. Nonetheless, still dead. But Gon's sitting at 119 right now. With a couple, uh, just a couple of uh, combos for Palutena, though. Not out of the realm of possibility. Just gonna eat those Hitting two him lasers. With both lasers, yeah. Rising neutral air. Another Catching one. the neutral get up. Mm. Tries to cover a uh, couple options with that man. Gonna miss space it though. Yeah, I'm just mm. trying to catch him slipping with the up tilt, but this grab should do it. Yep. Yep. And that is it. Khan's on his last stock right now. Yeah, looking um, pretty good. I like this. This FD seems to be working out pretty well yeah, for him. Definitely. It lets him play his neutral game really, really well right here. You know, just no platforms to interrupt, no platforms to get E to pressure on, mm -hmm. as well with the neutral airs. And this is uh, this is actually Gonza's counter pick. So, this is yeah, weird. absolutely. I mean, I don't know why he would do this stage. Maybe he just wanted to like, maybe he felt like he could just wall jackal out. Yeah. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. Knowing Gonza's playstyle, how lame this man is at his core. Yeah. A stage with no platforms, like um, when you're playing as Palutena, it's just like, dude, why? You can like, have such great platform pressure with the neutral air. Yeah. He's trying to wall him out. Absolutely. He's trying to just like not press buttons and like just press the right buttons at the right time to make it so he can't get in. And it's not working. You know? It's not, not working at all. And this now, I mean, Gonz is slowly creeping back, but he's not doing it fast enough. He's still taking too much damage uh, to be fighting against Wolf. Ooh. Ooh, and the spot dodge coming out from Jackal. Gon's still trying to punish that, uh, still trying to punish that forward smash. Once it comes out, if you're not there, you can't get there to punish it. You just gotta, kind of just gotta respect it. Back throw, gonna do it. Mm -hmm. Yep, 145, that's gonna kill just about everyone in the game. I think we can get an air strength potentially even this out right now, or if Jackal's gonna put another one on the board to potentially reset this bracket here. Okay, here we go, 140 saying on Gon's, uh, all of Wolf's kill moves are gonna kill you at this percentage, and a couple of his non-kill moves too. Okay. Yeah, for sure. I've been not to 70 percent. You know what it's gonna be, and the F tilt gonna yeah. do it right there. Yep. Spot dodges the back air, and then uh, immediately throws out an F tilt for his trouble. That was game two, right? Yep, that is game yeah. two. Let's see. Uh, let's see where we're going here. They're not gonna tell us. Oh, they just ran it back. You see, and it's funny because I'm seeing them at the character select screen, and I'm thinking they're going to choose the stage after. <laughs> it's so weird. Still uh, got Smash 4 habits. Not 2014 those, no more, dude. Right? But I'm going to go back. Let's see if Gon's uh, picked up on something new. That's why. It's because, like, Jackal can jump out of that. That's why he's going for the Elmer after the two Nairs. Yeah. I was wondering what the reason Makes was. Makes sense. See, there you go, mix up. Had to air dodge the back air, ended up just eating, uh, getting grabbed again for it, right back in the mix. Okay, that trade gonna put Jack in a situation where he can reset the neutral or maybe stay in advantage. And the stage, the back air there at the edge of the stage saved Gonza's life. Absolutely. Because he missed that tech. So he would have ate that down smash, absolutely. Nonetheless, uh, giving, giving Gonza a second chance at life. Hitting okay. him with the mini fox right there, the falling neutral air into the down smash as opposed to up smash. Nice. Catches him twice. Is that a down tilt that killed? No, that was uh, F tilt. Angle, I, I don't know if you can angle it, but. Uh, it was no, F -tilt. the kick, right? No, 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 that wasn't down tilt. That was uh, the, the F tilt. The claws. The claws, yeah. Okay. Because I, because I used to confuse like Wolf's down tilt with like an angle down forward tilt a lot, because it looks like an angle down yeah, forward tilt. Yeah, it looks tilt. like Fox and uh, it looks like Fox and Falco's forward tilt just on the ground. No, it's not. It's just a down tilt. Yeah. yeah. But Jackal, you see, um, poised once again, up yes. again. Has all the momentum right now. See, do a good job going low, not using your jump, avoiding the entire auto reticle. Okay. Back air. Oh, and he survived it. Nice. Yeah, saved his jump too. He air dodged first before yeah. using his jump. If he did it the other way around, he definitely would not have been able to make it back. And shining through the explosive yes, flame as well. Very smart. In a situation like that. I think my man learned the matchup. Yep. Palutena doesn't come off stage. He just, uh, he can just shine that. Oh, and that, uh, I was just about to say that. Where do you go? That down tilt, uh, putting him at two. He's too high percent for him to confirm anything off of it. But the fact that he had the air dodge forced him to have to go into the drop zone. And that nair lasts way too long for you to be able to spot uh, air dodge it. Mm -hmm. Okay, down tilt mix, 25%. Nice. I thought uh, the last one was going to be a neutral air. Mm -hmm. 
Wolf was a fast faller, so uh, he, it looked like he held down and just tried to get out of it. That was his uh, game plan in that situation. Yep. Let's see if Gans picks up on it next time. Mm. Okay, he tried to call out the jump. Uh, Jack will not giving it to him. I mean, Gans doing a good job of uh, bringing this one back. Even percentage, pretty much right now. Oh, whoa! Forcing him to jump, and he was still able to get the strong hit of the side B on his way back? Are you yeah, kidding that me? that was nice. That was really good. I had no idea he was even in a position to do that. Okay, and you see uh, Jack, he keeps trying to land on Palutena with Nair. That up tilt is going to beat that Nair uh, nine times out of three. And back throw should definitely not do it yet. Need to be a much higher percent for that. Gone's off stage, trying okay. to force his way back. Let's see the ledge trapping. No, forcing like, his way through with that invincible yeah. hitbox. Oh, just lets him down to the ground for free. Okay. Safe on block, invincible hitbox in the neutral. Both these nice. guys feeling each other out right now. He's able to break it with a dash attack. But the up tilt, raw, yeah. with the missed pivot grab right there, capitalizing yeah. on that situation. Try and grab in this game, you will eat something, man. That grab has a lot of uh, FAF frames. Now the question is, if, like, a Jackal resets this bracket right now, is there a counter pick from Gons? Mm, that's a good question. Best. That's Simon? A, that's a really Ness, I think maybe. And the crazy thing is, I think he either goes Simon or Ness because. Oh, well, well let's. Uh, we'll, we'll cross that, out that bridge when we come yeah. You know, he hasn't lost this game yet. Okay. He very well might be about to, though. He's up a full stock mm -hmm. in terms of both percent and Absolutely. stock right now. And now, now. He's, just, he's fighting for his life right now. And just I'm fighting for my the, life. He just went off stage. Wolf went off stage, trying to get the game. Yes. I'm thirsty for it, man. I yep. want to reset this bracket, win this tournament, and here we go. And he kind of, uh, and he kind of like misjudged that nair, and he might not have been able to make it back after that nair. He went really, really low. But yeah. nonetheless, he had a stock to play with, so. I think the, he was able I think to do the it. nair has enough, like, uh, has little enough end lag to the point yeah. where he would have been able to up-e back. Yeah. But maybe. Yeah, I definitely. Don't know. I mean, it was close. The point fact is, that it was close it makes it, like, scary for you to do that in a tight game. But uh, they're opting to go to PS2. Immediate Palutena. Yes. We're not switching. I need a top tier. That's what yep. my man is saying. One, yep. Go. I'm going to keep up. And now, as we were talking about, I would have liked to have seen the Simon because the, where Simon... Uh, where Simon is bad is off stage. Like he gets gimped super hard. Yeah. Wolf isn't going off stage. So yeah, yeah, that's true. But I mean, it's it's just gonna be really interesting how like he would deal with like Wolf Laser yeah. in the neutral because like Simon's airspeed is actually very very bad. It's uh -huh. like his major flaw as a character. So like he besides like parrying, he would have to like just jump above like the uh, Wolf Laser a lot, and then yeah. Wolf is just gonna like mix that up and like just not shoot the laser once he lands, and then just intercept him with like one of Wolf's amazing aerials. Yeah. Not that like so much Wolf is like a rushdown character because I agree. I think Belmont's like definitely do the worst against rushdown characters. It probably wouldn't have been too bad, but I think Wolf still would have probably had the upper hand there. Yeah. I would have liked to have seen it. I, I would have liked. I would have loved yeah. to see it too. But you know, Gon's like, I like to win. I need Palu. I need Palu. I mean, he did it. You know? Oh, you're dead. Oh no! Whoa! Oh, that he, sent away. Yeah, he did. Just like that. It's so. It happens so fast. It's like you're you're there, and then like you're not here anymore. <laughs> say it, man. Okay. Nah, he's gonna shield that uh, aggressive approach back to the stage. I'm just gonna um, give him a nair to put him back off. Nah, no jump. You're dead. Peace. Good job. And that was actually the first time that Jackal got hit by that. That's how yeah. he lost almost all of his stocks yeah. in Winners Finals. Exactly. So in this set, Jackal has kind of like adapted to it very well. Absolutely. But let's see if uh, Gans could do a little bit of adaptation himself. He had a whole set to do so. Now this is the reset. What you got, Gans? Okay, nice. Another empty out. Now he's implementing that once again. He wasn't doing it the last match or the, towards the end of that last set. Mm -hmm. Now he's implementing that empty hop again. Let's see how many times Gans lets him get away with that before he uh, before he turns it over. <gasps> that was a Ness habit. <laughs> that was absolutely was. a Ness habit. It was. He thought that Palutena had Ness's air dodge. <laughs> but she ain't got that. She may have everything, but she ain't got that. Mm -hmm. Like, oh my god, and the neutral air just stuffing that out before the backer even comes out. <laughs> Jackal, he, he's winning, man. He really wants to win this tournament. That was actually pretty hilarious. There's no reason why he should have thought Palutena was getting back from there. It was a mistake. <laughs> it was a mistake, man. Don't rip on him for it. Man. It's funny, but don't rip on him for it. That's crazy. Now he's sitting at 72%. Uh, Gaffa still has two stocks. Oh my gosh, he could have force smashed block. him again. Yeah. 
He could have just did it again or forward tilted, and he probably would have died. Wolf's forward smash is almost completely goes. safe on block, and there is the Wolf special. Mm -hmm. Actually, funny enough, you designed know? it's the opposite of Fox's. The falling neutral air to the down smash. Yeah, it's falling neutral air. It's interesting smash. how they designed it yeah. like that, considering That's he's like funny. the antagonist. But go on, That's what funny. were you saying? I was going to say, you know what's going to be funny? <laughs> if he picks an S now. <laughs> If he's like, uh, Gons, yeah, Gons. let me just go Ness. Gons, please, to the people. The people want you to play Ness. This is the only time the people will ever want nope. you to play Ness. He's going straight Palu. All right. Wow. And I, I don't think he, I don't think he tries anything, uh, game. Three, two, I don't think he tries anything game. Uh, if this goes to game three, if, if Jackal takes this set as well, mm -hmm. I don't think he tries anything else. Okay. Here we go. Dash attack. Dash attack. <laughs> Just gonna cover his landing twice, but uh, Jackal not afraid to be offensive in that situation. Absolutely not. Yeah. Okay. Back air. Okay. Couple bread and butters coming from Jackal now. What do you do? Down throw. Fair. You're off stage again. Explosive flame. Force wall blow. Get him with the explosive yes. flame. I mean, get him with the uh, the uh, what do you call the neutral beam and force him low again. Neutral that air. was slick. Yo, he had enough time to get there to get the grab, but he raw he raw um, approached him, emptied uh, landed and just grabbed him. That was so slick. Yeah, that was actually a sick fade. He made him think he was gonna do one thing and then just totally did another. Yeah, it was insane. Twice. Which is just a it mix. Was, it was two mix ups because he not only uh, baited him or uh, mixed him up with the, mm, back here, not gonna kill yet. Look at what percentage he almost died at. And that down smash would have killed him. Absolutely. Fully charged. Yeah, that was insane. Okay, they're going to do it. Good job. Take that rage away from Wolf. Wolf is a rage monster, man, so. Yeah, that back air kills him 100%. And there you go. Mess with him. Forward down. smash. Safe on block. Mm -hmm. Okay. Jackal understanding the, the, there are a lot of moves that he can kill him with, so he's just trying to pick the right one. Not trying to overextend. Okay. I'm going to keep him in the corner. Good job. Spot Dodge is going to get that grab onto, onto Gans. Okay. Oh no, just going for the fair instead. Kicking yeah. the crotch. Not gonna kill. Mm, Kick is not good. Yeah. <laughs> Try to cover that landing with the with the dash attack. I like the not I like the double jump it. over the auto reticle uh yes. hitboxes right there with the back air. Definitely what you want to do. If you can bait out that auto reticle and you're in the air, you still have your second jump, you could definitely punish that. If your character is fast and small yeah. enough too, you can just run below him. Mm -hmm. And just grab her for it. Yep. If she ever does it in neutral, which most palus aren't gonna do in certain situations. That's why I like Roy. He kind of like shifts his herbox down. Exactly. When he, he like runs. And then, uh, so if I'm running out of Palutena and she tries her explosive flame or auto reticle, yeah, you're going to eat this dash attack. You know who doesn't do that anymore? Who? Luigi. Ugh. Just stand straight up. Like, oh! Oh. Uh, uh, I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't know, man. I don't know how I feel about that. Yeah, you know, I, I just, it, it's okay. Last stock. Ran out of stage to be able to get that uh, dash attack on. Gon's just dipping a little low to avoid it. And now the Nair String, air dodging the up air with perfect timing is Jackal to get out of that Palutena combo. Maybe that was a misinput. I don't know. It's a, it's a pretty good misinput. But I mean, I guess it was you a misinput. I guess you reset the neutral, like, completely. Yeah. <laughs> Not only, like, in positioning, but in uh, percentages. Nice air dodge. Okay. Gon's just trying to, like, find his footing, though. Um, Momentum still in uh, Jackal's favor. But just like that, he's off the stage. Supposed flame, going to put him right back up in the air. How do you get back down to the ground? Kind of mix it up with your uh, with your aerial mobility. Not that it's great, but good enough to get you out of that situation. Okay. Mm. Jackal try, uh, holding on to this rage right now. 122 sand on him. He has a lot of things that he can do. To Whoa. That was dash attack yeah. that just got beat. I guess he hit him in the head. Or hit Palutena in the head, and Palutena doesn't have, uh, like, invincibility on Ooh, her head. Oh, you're in a bad spot with the falling there! Yeah, that sucks. He didn't even, like, go back on stage after the fair. He just con continued to drift past the edge of the stage and threw out the nair. Yeah. Because <laughs> he knew it was just going to work. Yeah, that sucks. Not only is that good to catch the two-frame, but uh, if you air dodge it, you just, you just get it deleted. Okay. I'm sorry, I need pretzels. Nah. I'm so hungry. <laughs> no worries. But I mean, really good job by uh, Gans to close that one out. And these guys look tired, but, but I mean, it's grand fight. Grand top eight was really long today. We had a lot of like really long sets in top eight. Yeah. 
much longer than I thought it was going to be. We didn't have Leon to side beat people uh, to death. Leon, <laughs> Leon literally speed uh, ran the bracket at Legacy 1. <laughs> Not because he was like completely bodying people, but the games were just so fast. He was just side beat people, people would give him. He'd side beat people, people would give him. Yeah. And then that was the end of the game. <laughs> That's true. Nonetheless. Um, yeah, shouts to Leon, man. Jack was in here. A couple combos, a couple early percentage combos. Going to put Gons at disadvantage. 101 sitting on his uh, first stock. Ooh. Okay. That air dodge. I don't know what Jack was really. Oh, maybe he was waiting for an air dodge in. Directional air dodge in. Potentially, yeah. Yeah. Jack has to cover that for sure. That had so much shield stun. Gons' input right didn't even come out. He tried to dash grab and he didn't even get it. Okay. Rising to Drillair caught the jump. And the thing is, uh, Gon just trying to down tilt his up B. Uh, in a lot of situations, like, it's a scary thing. Because if you get hit with the wrong hitbox on that up B, it's just going to yank you right off the side of the stage. Mm. Ooh, anything yeah. you can do, I can do better. Yeah, absolutely. He tried to read the spot dodge, didn't give it to him, and he ate a forward smash. For oh, you like, uh, you like that frame 50 F smash? <laughs> oh, here you go. Here's 10. Yeah. Or something like that. Here's just great. some significantly smaller number. Oh. Oh. And that's the thing about Explosive Flame. Um, even if it's not hitting you initially, the blast get, radius gets bigger. So, like, if you're standing close to it and not getting hit, you might still get hit if you stand there. Well, that's one of the differences between a top player and a mid-level player. Mid-level player just tries to hit you with everything. Gons, with his Explosive Flames, he knows he's forcing Jackal into a different position with yeah. him. He knows he's forcing him to go low even if he misses the Explosive Flame. He's like, if it hits, good. If yeah. it doesn't, it's forcing him to go low. And then I can yeah. auto-reticle him. And good he job. knows that. Now, good job by Gons in that situation. In the last time, the last situation like that one, he threw out an F smash to cover the spot dodge. This time, he obviously just used a jab, which was a lot safer. Um, not safe, but um, a lot safer than throwing out an F smash. And he, and he actually got rewarded for it. But that dash attack gonna uh, clip Jackal on his retreat to the middle of the stage. Okay, not just think it's good. Yep. <laughs> How do we get back to the? Um, to the edge of the stage now. Gons are scared. That ill-advised dash attack. Mm -hmm. Sitting at really high percent. Wolf he was has just really good there tools. For it, man. Yeah. Come on. Too many good tools uh, for you to throw that move out. Okay. Nice nair. Yeah, platform pressure with the nair, man. It's so easy. Covers the whole thing, my dude. Ooh, an explosive flame in neutral, but he gets a grab off of uh, Jackal's approach, actually, and forces him off stage, almost gimping him, actually. That would have been huge. Yeah, absolutely. Especially for this game, since he's down a whole stock. Back he didn't let it happen to him, though. Okay. If Gans could, uh, Gans could really turn the tide here if he's able to take a stock. Yeah, nice had the dodge. situation, but there was a really good air dodge coming out from Jackal. Really good reactions. You know what move we haven't seen from Gans? What? Oh, because... Might be dead, yeah, in the go. reach. Yikes. Hit him with the Manny Petty, the claws. Yikes. Whoa, now, I, as I was getting ready to say, you know a move we haven't seen from Gons? What? Up smash. That covers the ledge really well. But I mean, it he's, covers been, the using, ledge really he's well. been using dash attack. I mean, um, down tilt, which is also a really good move that covers the ledge really well. It covers the ledge really well, but I will admit, it is committal. Mm -hmm. Palutena yes. misses that, it's a punish. You're right. You're right. So that, that's why we haven't. But seen off stage, it's a uh, scary. Yeah, thing. he could just rise with a fair and then like land another forward air or something, potentially a nair, and just like, you know, Wolf gets all that damage all of a sudden. It might not be as good off stage unless you know for a fact that like Wolf is going to do this, unless you go for the hard, 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 hard read. But anyway, final destination is the pick. Yes. What is potentially the final game of Legacy Chapter 2? Jackal needs one more to be able to win this tournament, resetting from the okay. first bracket, resetting in grands, and Greg Gonzalez needs two more to be able to win this. Let's yep. see what they can do. And you see Gans, uh, you can already see him playing, uh, slowing this game down uh, completely. He does not want to try and box with uh, Jackal. He kind of wants to pick him apart slowly and outlast him. So I'm not too sure how that's going to be a uh, bid for him, but uh, it seems to be working right now. Yeah, so far it's actually working out pretty well for him right now. I mean, he's even like catching like his get-up options with like a neutral air or just any other type of move. And look at all the damage he's really getting for it in the meantime. The lack of platform seems to be working wonders for him right now and catching his landings. Except for when he misses with dash attacks like that. But for the most part, it's working out pretty well for him. Okay, nice em empty land into uh, to back throw. Ooh, gonna miss that grab. Gonna eat a jab forward by Wolf. Okay. And Jack will still be still being offensive. Uh, and he kind of just falls right into it. Right I don't, the not, too sure, uh, not too sure what he wanted out of that one. 
fair to back uh to back down. Pretty sure that's safe. There we go. Dash attack. Ooh, Ooh. trying to hit it with the hard read instead of going for another dash attack, potentially not wanting to steal it. And he's just spamming it now. Look, ah, yo, looking like scary. me. He's looking like me right Absolutely. now. Absolutely. That ain't Mario. Nah, that's not Mario. That's not Mario. That fast smash I mean, is safe on block. Pretty, pretty I mean, scary. Mario's is if you space it right, which is pretty easy to do. But that wolf, on the other hand, it doesn't matter how you space it. You shield that move, it's not going to matter. It has yeah. such a little lag. He's going to be able to run away, do another one, do whatever he wants, yeah. really. It has a lot of hits on as well, so. Exactly. Well, you see Gon playing uh, really, really safe. He understands he still needs... Ah, just he needs like to, that. He understands he needs to not get kicked in yeah. the chest. <laughs> That's what he needs, but unfortunately, that understanding didn't mean anything. He's going to get kicked in the chest anyway and lose his first stock. Okay. No neutral there. I thought, I thought he was going to nair right there. He's, he's playing Palutena, so I thought he was going to nair, but still. Right. I really thought that's what he was going to go for there. Back throw, going to put him off stage. How do we get back? Down two. If he okay. landed that fair, he would have died. Not from the fair itself, but he would have been too far away. And then, like, Gons just would have auto reticled and gimped him again with it. Which, gotta, which I gotta say, for the most part, Jackal's adaptation is huge from Winners Finals. He's doing such a good job at avoiding that situation. Yeah. He got hit by it yes. so many times last game, and an unfortunate air dodge SD gonna come out to Jackal, showing that literally the best of us do that. But yeah, Jackal's just adaptation is just so amazing. He's just yes. doing such a good job of not getting hit by that. He lost like almost all of his stocks in Winners Finals to that. And like now, he got hit by it like once in both sets. Yep. It's, it's, it's really good. Yeah, yeah, the auto radical is a really good option for uh, Edge Guarding Wolf. And I don't think uh, Jackal wants this game to go to a game uh, a game five. No, I he think he wants to win right here. Yeah. He's, ooh, and that explosive flame going to catch him. How do we get back down to the ground? We don't. I think he did touch the floor, going to get his jump. Nonetheless, neutral uh, going to get reset. The counter? No. I've never seen that move kill. Neither have I. Unless it was a gimp. Wow. Yo, everybody forgets that Palutena has a counter. We all, we all need to forget because she shouldn't have a counter. Hey man, that's a, that's us complaining. Hey man, she has a sword. Well. She has a sword. She's a sword character. She has a, she, she has a staff. She has a sword character. It's a staff. Like Raiden. Raiden has a staff now. Oh, she does. She does. You'll see me in MK11. I cannot <laughs> wait. I'm gonna play that. Game that game. Yo, please. Yo, we got. Yo, we gotta play. It's gonna be nice. We gotta play. It's gonna be. It's on Switch too. It's gonna be fresh. It's gonna be fresh. See my job. And we had. Oh, they played the same Go. characters. All Day. three sets. For all three sets. Yes. Yeah. All these guys committing. Yeah. They're brand new fangled top tiers. Yeah. I mean, Jude already made the top tier before. He played Pichu. Oh! oh! I knew it. He hasn't tried that the entire, the entire. Um, he was saving it for set. the last game to make sure it worked. But even like I felt that was coming. I'm not surprised at that at all. Oh no. But I mean, now that I'm thinking about it. Uh, Jackal didn't have any any options. No. Like, he didn't have a jump. He didn't, uh, he couldn't air dodge. His aerials weren't going to come out fast enough to contest it. And his up B has all the startup in the world. Yeah, he was dead. And there's some fair string. Oh, my God. Down tilt. Nice. Down he knew back he was trying. coming to the start of this, the beginning of the stage. Now, Gans figured something out. This is a completely different game. Either that or he just got an early stock and he's doing a really good job at forcing his advantage. Yeah. That's this another is, thing. This is really good. Oh, he just waited. Back there, we're gonna put him on stage. Dude, he just waited. I feel I'm gonna feel so bad if he wins. Jude fought so hard. Yeah. <laughs> but it ain't over yet though. And here we go. Okay. Gonna empty now he empty landed with the grab, but uh he actually got the tech out of it. My man spamming the down tilt. Uh, that was his second time actually recovering high with the up beat. Jackal's gonna try and cover that next time he does it. Mm. Ooh, up smash and trying to get Rob back. Those yes. gonna do it. He's down two stocks. Jackal holding his heart. Yes, this Actually, is not looking good. He's looking there. very grim. If he does this, he's a god. Okay. I mean, but he's taking the nair right now. I don't know. Uh, I don't know how he should feel about this. 122 cent on the great Gonzalez Jackal on his last stock. He has one last string <laughs> left on this rope before it breaks. Yeah, he needs to take this stock now if he wants any chance of bringing yeah. it back. No, you got, hit by, you got hit by a pallet neutral air, but then you got to grab it your own. Okay. Tossing him go. off. Off stage. No auto reticle coming out because it got hit by the actual stage. Mm. F-tilt. Nice. That's yeah. one. There we go. I say Jackal can't go over 80%. I say he can. I, I don't think so. I think if he goes over 80%, he loses his game. I'll bet a dollar. Okay, this is looking good. 
Oh, that's almost. Oh, oh God. my gosh. Already at 60. That was two hits. Oh, my God. That was God. three hits. Oh, ah, 80.9. Just, uh, uh, just this might be 80.9. <laughs> I said over 80, though. So he has to go to 81. He has to go to 81. Oh, that's technically over 80, but you're right. You're right. Oh, yo, okay. he might not do it. Here we go. Yo, Sheldon. Here we go. Sheldon. Here we go. Sheldon. Oh, in the back here. That's over I think, right. uh, Okay, one more neutral exchange. If he yeah. sets the neutral, he can he can do it. He can't he can't go get put in disadvantage again. Oh, not gonna do not it. Gonna, this is not looking good. Auto reticle. Thinks low to avoid it. There you go. Has oh. to air dodge. He I'm has, surprised. He's forced to right there. I, I'm surprised he didn't frame trap him. But there you go. That is it. You don't you can't give Gans too many chances to uh to delete you, man. Gans is one of the best punishers in Jersey. Not only in this game, but um. In Smash 4, his play style, he's just a great uh, pun. His punish game is, like, really, really good. Second to James and Nairo in the state. Absolutely. Absolutely, man. And hey, got to clap it up for him. Yep. Gons, your legacy Chapter 2 champion. Good job. Woo! Yes, definitely. Clap good it up for your boy. Yeah. And you can tell, like, even, even today, like, Gons has a certain presence that he kind of carries when he's at a tournament. Today, he just seemed different. Um, not that, like, I mean, like he was weird or anything, but he just seemed different. His presence was different. It was very confident. It was very like uh, tournament mode. Yeah, exactly. He definitely looked like he was in tournament mode, ready to win this event. So good job by him. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. But well, shouts to uh, shouts to House of Three Thousand. Yeah. For uh, wonderful streamers streaming the best uh, of the business. this event. Uh, couldn't uh, can't thank them enough. They do such a really good job. This stream setup. Every time I see it, it just upgrades. So if you guys are looking to hire House, uh, definitely do it. Stand up, people. Um, Legacy Tournament. The next one, actually, we have the wrong slide up. The next one is actually going to be April 27th. We just got an update the weekend after Pound. So it's going to be huge. We got enough time to promote, enough time to get more people here. It's definitely going to be a sight to see. Um, April 27th is the next event. Uh, be there at B Square. I'm not sure when the next Xeno Saga is. That's going to be another one that uh, people don't want to miss. Actually, now that your date has been sorted, Mm -hmm. I'll take the 13. Oh, ah, okay. All right. There you go. So Xeno Saga is going to be on April. What about my 13th? tournament? Uh, Nintendo Saga. Yeah, it's, it's being hosted out of my garage. Yeah. Nintendo. Oh, he's already leaving. See you later, guys. Good job, guys. <laughs> I was about to say, I was going to be like, I don't know if you guys do interviews. I would I would be down to do that. It's yeah. up to. Yeah, Gans probably doesn't guys. want to do an interview. He nah, like, no, he's he already dipping. Like he's Jude go. definitely does not want to do an interview. Way. He just lost. You don't want to do that. Oh, you can interview me. My name's Goffinant. See right, you later. This is my Twitter. Oh, oh, oh I was going to do it. I was going to be like, yo, yo, all right. Yo, we got my man Goffinant. Uh, okay. He's hosted Legacy Chapter yeah, 2. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, uh, so, so, so how do you feel about... Oh, oh my God. You good? Oh, oh you just oh, 